Yesterday I was on the uh, Wagner's granulomatosis disease support uh, forum. <laughs> And I, I learned of the death of one of our regular contributors, uh, a, a, a sweet, funny woman who, who lived in British Columbia and who, like the rest of us, either had Wigner's granulomatosis or our family of people who have Wigner's. She isn't the only person who's died in the year or so that I've been on the forum as a contributor and as somebody who've, who's learned quite a lot too from the postings of others. But for some reason I don't know. I don't know. After I posted a, a thought for her daughter Carmen, a, an expression of sympathy, I sat back in my, my computer chair and I just started falling. No, no two ways about it. I was just overwhelmed with grief. I don't know why I never met her. So because people on the forum tend to keep <laughs> track of each other, which is good. It's very good. I posted a note telling people on the forum that I just was going to have to stand back and and deal with my grief. I couldn't put my finger on it. That was the hard part for me. If I if I know why I'm grieving, I can deal with it. But when it just hits me that way, oh, but I didn't want them to be concerned. I've only met one of them. One of the, excuse me. People on the forum, Lisa Coffee, love her from Minnesota. <laughs> like so many of us, people with Wagner's, we don't we don't look sick for the most part, and and I think. Part of the difficulty of dealing with the death of our friend in British Columbia was she probably didn't look sick either except when she went to the hospital. Yet we have a disease that potentially could just kill us. Today when I was walking my cat, the perfect the perfect bet for a person with Wagner's granulomatosis because they walk, they sit, they dig a hole, they poop, but they don't walk straight and they wander all over the place, usually underneath people's bedroom windows where you're embarrassed to see them and you can't get them to get away from there. But anyway, the sky over Nebraska was so beautiful. Still is. I'm looking out my window through these big puffy clouds, and I thought, through my Christian filter, <laughs> thank you, God, for the blessings of this day, among which I was getting to know Moyan a little bit before she died, and also the beauty of of the day that I was experiencing. I am alive to experience another day. Thank you, God. Well,